the other one was able to notice that obviously if there was something happening that shouldn't have been happening and they were able to advise the person to exit. There was also waist deep flooding across the street at Shady Oaks Plaza. Fire Rescue says that was caused because a drain was full. Let's get a first check of the weather now with meteorologist Alex Calamia. And Alex, Ocala was hit pretty hard today. Yeah, Ocala hit very hard by those storms. It was just a very slow moving storm that was sitting over the area, bringing lots of rain and lightning. Also, Lafayette County into Suwannee County brought a lot of rain and lightning to that area today as well. Let's take a look at the viewer photo of the day from Rhonda in Ocala. You can see how flooded that block was, and it actually looks like that car was running all the way in the corner by that tree there. You can see the headlights are on, so hopefully nobody was actually inside the car. But really, you just had to be very careful driving out there because where the roads were flooded, you didn't know how deep that water was, and you could easily get caught in it. But the good news is, without that daytime heating, everything is all 